Hey everyone, welcome to Data Millennials. I am Atul and in this video we are going to discuss about the year function and this year function comes under date and time function in SQL. So let's go and see what exactly is the year function. So this year function returns the four digit year number of a given particular date. Now in your SQL tables you will always see that you have date column. And if you want to extract the year part of that column, then you can use this year function to extract the four digit year. So in our previous video, we had used month day function to get the day and the month of this transaction date column. Now, if we want to get the year of this transaction date as a separate column, then we can use the year function. And to do that, we will simply put year and then we will put the column name, which is transaction date and we'll give an areas as fee year and now if i'll run this query you will see that we will have a separate column fee year in which the year of this transaction date is extracted so let's run this query okay after running this query we have this new column fees year and you can see that this fees year contains 2021 and in your transaction date all of the dates are from 2021 so this is how basically you can use this year function to get the year as a column in SQL table from a given specific date. If you want to learn more about SQL, you can click on the right hand side of this video or you are interested in Excel, then you can click on the left hand side of this video. Happy learning and see you in the next video.